I'm Marian. I'm an animator at Framestore. Oh, that sounded weird. I work on the animation team and we craft movements for characters in films. I get given scenes and have to interpret movements from actors or creatures into the final performance. We get a character modeled by modelers. After that comes rigging, where they put controllers onto the model of the character. And we have tons of controllers everywhere, so we can make each little tiny facial subtle expression. In pre-production of a project, you could come in and do some rig testing first and that it's anatomically correct what you want to achieve. Then you would do some test animations to see if uh, creature effects or groom looks nice when it is animated in a certain kind of way. Like if there's a stomp down, then there would be muscle wiggle. If you go out of pre-production and actually come into production, you would get a scene. You would read the script of the movie, but first you would have to prepare your research. I would go on the internet and just uh, look at lots of YouTube videos of, for example, for Paddington, because Paddington is like, has very, very human aspects to himself. So we would film ourselves as a reference to do the actions he does in the movie. So if you have your body mechanics down in the scene, then you would go more into details into the face, for example, and do the lip sync if he's talking like what kind of shapes his tongue does while he's talking. There's also a lot of problem solving involved. You have to be um, very detailed and specific in knowing how the character behaves and move and what he would do in certain situations. So I think that's the challenge, but uh, yeah, it's very fun to figure that out. Creating personalities of characters who sometimes don't exist. That's what I love. Anyone can become an animator if they love creating life and movement. You could train like your observational skills, go out to the zoo and see how the animals move or how people move. It's like a different way of thinking. The technical skills that you need for this job, you could like learn through school or online courses. I studied a uh, Bachelor of Character Animation in Denmark and then came here to do the summer internship at Framestore. The real, like, bringing the character to life, you have to have, like, an eye for appealing visuals, but you can learn that and just practice a lot. Go to festivals and network with a lot of people because if you get feedback on your animations, it always helps to bring it up to the very uh, high quality that we do here. Each animator for themselves has their own handwriting, you can say. And uh, we always put like our like um, life into the character.